Hey, blessings, Fierce Butterflies. It's Coach Renee. I pray everybody is doing well. I'm out here on the porch. When I tell y'all it's been storming, raining, oh my God. It has been storming. And so now we have a break in the weather. And I am about to work on a little project out here on the porch before the weather starts again because we do know it's going to be raining again. It's supposed to be raining all day with the thunder and lightning. And as long as it's raining, I'm cool out here on the porch. But when God starts talking with the boomeranging and the, and the lightning and all, no. I'm going to show some respect. I'm going in the house and getting off this porch. But anyway, I wanted to come and show y'all this quick project I'm about to work on. I got these nice little jars here from the Dollar Tree, of course. And um, I got me some solar lights also from the Dollar Tree. And I'm going to uh, put them out in the yard. So I originally was going to make me some cute little mushrooms uh, with the jars. I'm still going to do mushrooms, but I think today I'm going to do the solar light um, project first. Sorry about that. Anyway, I got these um, little bowls from the Dollar Tree as well. And so what I'm going to do, I'm going to get some green paint and just make some designs on top of it and set them out in the yard. I was going to do that now, but I'm going to wait. So we're going to place that little bowl where he goes. So in the meantime, what I'm doing today is really simple. I'm just going to take the um, solar light apart and I'm going to use it in the jar. Now, I like when I can use this bottom part in there because it just gives it another effect for some reason this they all seem the same size but the green one doesn't seem to want to work with this part on there these here sit right in there and so i'm going to go ahead and glue these around uh the edges to make sure that they stay and of course when the light comes on uh yeah you can't really see it because of course it's daylight but if you can see the light does come on so at night that's going to be really really pretty uh like i said for some reason this green one is not cooperating in that way so basically what i'm gonna do is still, still gonna make it work but what i gotta do let me see if i can do this with one hand no hold on hang on y'all okay so basically what i did i just twisted this part here off and i'm going to use this part here as you can see the light is working the light is on and so instead of using the whole part i just put that part down and you'll get the same effect see the light still comes on and so I'm going to glue those around there and I'm going to set them out in the yard. I'm going to make some for me, some for my daughter. She likes when I do these type of things. Also, I got my E6000 glue here ready to go. I'm going to do that little project. I probably will find one more project to do. And um, back in the house I go. But I just wanted to share that with you all. When I put them out in the yard, maybe I'll come out here and get a little night footage to show y'all the final outcome but it's going to be really pretty but yeah alrighty fierce butterflies I hope y'all can see them I know the spotlight may be a little bright but if you look around you will notice there's a, the purple one the green one the pink one uh, that I set around the um, bushes that are out here and um, I'm not going to get too close because it's been raining all day. So it is soaking wet out here on the ground. And I'm not about to step in that wet grass. Uh-uh. But anyway, I hope y'all can see it. But those are the projects that I just finished working on. So yeah, if you want to add a little color to your yard and you don't want to spend a whole lot of money and you're just looking for something to occupy your time during this quarantine, just find some little small projects out here at... Um, Dollar Tree put something together and get a little creative that's all I can say but anyway here's another little uh, thing I have my fern here and um, it was just sitting so I just took a, um, a light I didn't add any color to it but I just 
stuck it in the middle of the fern and gave it a nice little glow around the edges but yeah that's it but um just wanted to show y'all that update thanks for watching remember to subscribe to the channel give my thumbs up on the video so until my next video let's do what we do we're going to be good to ourselves and we're going to be good to one another because it makes the world a much happier place blessings